I know what you're thinking. Why is this man wearing a Canadian tuxedo? Two things. Number one, as a Canadian American, I'm allowed to make that joke. And number two, this is the 2021 Hyundai Venue Denim. Is this little SUV any good? Let's find out. The Venue is Hyundai's newest and smallest SUV. It competes with other front wheel drive based SUVs like the Kia Soul, the Nissan Kicks, and the Toyota CHR. That's right, front wheel drive. There is no all wheel drive. So the Venue then is for people who want an SUV without any off road capability. Well, why would you buy something like this? Easy. The SUV has largely replaced the sedan in America and has almost totally gotten rid of the station wagon. So if you want something small and inexpensive that still has a lot of cargo capacity, a vehicle like this is your best bet. As far as design goes, in a lot of ways, the venue looks like a shrunken Hyundai Palisade. You know, it's supposed to. You know, this grill would be at home on a Palisade. Plus you have the brand's now signature rectangular-ish daytime running lights. And I think they've done a good job. The front of the thing looks more premium than it is. But I think they've done a better job here on the side, making the venue read as an actual off-roader, even though we know it's not. You've got these big swollen fenders, right? It screams power. You've got smallish wheels that are wrapped in high profile tires. And you've got a lot of black plastic here on the wheel well, which, you know, makes it look tough. And like, you know, you can hit a rock and not care. They've also done a great job of shrinking the car's visual mass. This white roof here, it's exclusive to the denim trim level. It does a nice job of just, you know, shrinking the height of the car. And then down here on the door sill, you've got this black plastic trim with a little bit of chrome. It looks really nice, but again, it shrinks the size of the door visually. It's a nice trick. It's a really good job. This part's not such a nice job. It kind of just looks like a Tangram set, but that's okay. Out back, just reads like any other SUV. The point I want to drive home, though, is that for what's essentially an entry level vehicle, Hyundai has put an awful lot of time and effort into the design of the venue, and you just don't see that too often. We will get to the seats in a moment, I promise. But first, I want to make a blanket statement about inexpensive car interiors. It usually feels that the maker of said cars are trying to punish you for not having more money. You didn't buy their more expensive car, well, then you will forever have a terrible interior to sit in to remind you of how poor you are. The opposite is true here in the Venue Denim. This is a great interior, starting with these seats. Look at them. Okay, I don't think it's really, you know, denim like my uh, tuxedo here, but it's a really cool blue cloth seat with a cool pattern. And then look at the rest of the seat. We've got, I don't think it's leather, but it's blue vinyl. You've got white piping, you have white contrast stitching. You never see that in cars in this price range. And then that motif continues. The steering wheel is blue leather with white contrast stitching. So it's a shift boot. This is blue. Um, this is uh, off white. If this was in a Porsche, you could call it yachting blue and charge, you know, five grand for the pleasure of having these two colors. And then look at the rest of the design. You've got this nice bright work. You know, it, it's, it looks like chrome. It's actually plastic, but it looks good. The HVAC controls are nice. The housing here around the, the shifter, it, it looks really high end. And then you've got this infotainment screen. It's not huge, but look at how high quality it looks. Look at how premium it looks. Tons of contrast, it's really bright. Plus, you know, all Hyundais have this now, but look, little vacuum tubes that show you the radio station you're on, that's pretty cool. And navigation, look at this. A car that costs less than 25 grand has full navigation. Even if you're not into that, this car of course comes with Apple CarPlay or Android Auto, so it really is fully loaded. I mentioned earlier how I was surprised by the attention to detail that they paid to the exterior design of the car. Well, there's even more attention to detail here on the interior. Color me impressed, especially with these seats. Remember all those nice things I had to say about the design of the venue? Turns out I don't have many nice things to say about its performance. Look. Under the hood, it's a naturally aspirated 1.6 liter inline four. It's 121 horsepower, 113 pound feet of torque. All of that goes into a continuously variable transmission that only powers the front wheels. The venue is slow by 2021 standards. Also, it's not very good to drive and it doesn't handle very well. 
But at least the fuel economy is great, right? Uh, no, in fact, it's kind of middling. It's, it's 30 miles per gallon in the city, which is okay. 33 on the highway. Why isn't it better if you have such a you know anemic engine? Shouldn't you at least get something out of it? Well, the answer is it's an SUV, and SUVs are bigger and heavier and less aerodynamic than cars, and so the fuel economy suffers. Is the venue's performance in line with the competition? Yes, it is. None of them are very good. In terms of safety, the venue is a fairly safe car. It has a four-star front and rollover crash rating. Uh, although it does have a five-star crash rating if you get hit from the side. If you get the denim trim level, which adds the LED headlights, it becomes a 2021 top safety pick. Is there room for improvement? Sure. It would be better if it was a five-star crash rating all around, and it would be nice if it had adaptive cruise control. For now, it doesn't. How much? Well, you can actually get yourself a brand new Hyundai venue for less than $20,000. That's less than half the average transaction price of a brand new car. That's incredible. More incredible, the denim spec. This is the top model, fully loaded, $23,390. And as we saw on the interior, the feature per dollar ratio on this vehicle is huge. A fully loaded Nissan Kicks undercuts it by a couple of hundred bucks. However, the venue like this, it's cheaper than a comparable Kia Soul and a few thousand dollars less than a similar Toyota CHR. If there's one thing I want you to know about the 2021 Hyundai Venue Denim, it's that it's got a lot of character. If you take performance off the table, if you forget all about off-road capability, what you're left with is an inexpensive, practical, stylish, feature-loaded small SUV that has really, really cool seats. And for some people, that's plenty. To see vehicle rankings and a complete buyer's guide, please visit motortrend.com cars.